Hi, this is Manu. Hi, this is Steen. Steen, our last video, we finished it talking about the challenges and opportunities that our physical technologies can bring us. Yeah. And uh, many people asked uh, in the comments on social networks that why social technologies must be adapted to physical technologies. Can you explain us, please? Yeah, yeah, I'll try to do that. But I think before we can address this in an orderly manner, we have to have a structured conversation about these changes. This is a really complicated stuff, and, and the scientific community is not completely in agreement about what's going on. So let me try to define a structured conversation so we can address these very interesting questions. Okay. So, Steve. What do you write on the blackboard? Can you explain us, please? Yeah, this is how uh, I think um, um, you can have a conversation, a, an ordered conversation or structured conversation about this. I have um, made a diagram where we have humans in the middle. So the big issue is, of course, what does it mean to be human? And uh, this is in part determined by our physical technologies and all of our social technologies, which are up here, which is in part our economy, our culture, and our institutions. And later on, when we have to discuss how these different things are changed, then our technology influences our institutions, our economy, and as well as our culture. But our economy and our culture and institutions also interact. But it all, so, so just to, to sum up, so these are our social Technology. These I are see. the social technologies and these are our physical technologies. I see. And of course our physical technologies also influence our environment, which is very important. There are some big changes there. And change change the history too. Yeah, yeah. So another very important thing is that we have to look at how these different components, how they change over time. That's why history is very important. And also we can learn a lot from history because you know some of these things that are happening has actually happened earlier in human history. Okay, so looking at this, this information, we can say that the real conversation starts with explaining which are the physical technologies. Yeah, we, we need to, in my opinion, we need to start uh, discussing what these physical technologies are, because without knowing what they can do, then it's very difficult to have a, an intelligent conversation about what they do to the institutions, to our economy, and to our culture, as well as, of course, uh, what it means to be okay. human. So the message is so clear. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you.